Governor's Academy is a program on the rise in Class B of the NEPSAC. In just two years, head coach Mike Shelton has brought them from obscurity to 18-8 and and a second-place finish in the ISL. And he did it with a young team that's only going to keep getting better in the years to come. It starts with Will Batchelder and Holden Simons, who both arrived as underclassmen last year. Batchelder is one of the premier shot makers in all of New England, and he's got the confidence and moxie to rise to the occasion when it matters the most. He's far from one-dimensional, though, as he continues to fill out physically, add new weapons to his scoring arsenal, and learn to operate as a lead guard. Simons is a man among boys relative to most underclassmen in the region. He's always been physical, aggressive, and able to play through contact. But after adding 25 pounds of muscle mass to his frame in the last year, the sophomore forward is bullying and going right through just about anybody these days, while simultaneously expanding his perimeter skill set. Drew Sachs is another key returner and double-figure scorer from last year. He's a knockdown shooter from behind the three-point line and already committed to Bates. Peyton O'Leary and Vir Yadov add two more experienced seniors to the backcourt. Liam Dunphy and Marcus Bucknell provide two quality senior forwards. Dunphy has improved significantly since last season and is now on his way to accepting a walk-on spot on Bryant's roster, while Bucknell remains open in his recruitment but has long arms, broad shoulders, and a soft touch that should intrigue college coaches. There's also a pair of very intriguing juniors on the roster. Kalu Anya has made major strides since last season and should be poised for a breakout year. He's exceptionally long, with broad shoulders and a sculpted frame. He's always had the ability to put the ball on the floor at his size, but now he's getting to the rim and making plays with ease. Ryan Rudnick is a six foot eight forward from Canada in his first year with the program. He needs to fall in love with the weight room and fill out, but he's mobile and bouncy with soft touch and face-up potential, so there's clear long-term upside here. Mason Zernich, a hard-nosed and tough guard, Cade Sachs, an undersized spark plug, and Tristan Abood, a versatile six-foot-three forward, round out the junior class. While Governors is again playing games, there's no denying that the pandemic robbed them of what would have been another significant step forward in a full season as this is a program that is being built to win championships, and they have a championship coach here to show them the way.